Thank you for using our church and thank you for taking the time to watch this short video. A lot of the subject matter covered you will know anyway, but this is just to make sure. This video covers keeping safe, leaving the building, warning others, being upstairs and tackling the fire. These are covered in order of importance. Keeping safe. Two simple rules. First, please don't remove or move the fire extinguishers except in an emergency. And second, please don't wedge open the fire doors. A fire door will hold back a fire for at least 30 minutes. The fire doors at the top and bottom of the stairs have a special hold open system which will close automatically if the alarm is activated. To keep a door open, don't use a wedge, just press down on the plunger on the top of the mechanism and to release, flick up the opposite way, leaving the building. In the case of fire, you have the option to try and extinguish it. But don't be a hero, your own safety and getting others out of the building come first. We can replace the building. Leave the building by the nearest exit. Every fire exit has a sign similar to this one. As you leave, set off the alarm. If you are in the hall, the exit route is through this door turn left and through the gate onto Harby Lane. An alternative gate leads to the car park. Remember to assemble, don't just go home. The assembly point is in the car park. Warning others. The best way to warn others is to set off the alarm. The alarm has smoke detectors, but if it is not sounding, set it off. You do this by pushing this button between the arrows. These call points, as they're known, are located next to every exit and at the top of the stairs. If you haven't already, now is the time to dial 999. Upstairs. If you are upstairs and there's a fire, the fire alarm call point is at the top of the stairs. You should leave the building by going down the stairs and turning left through the Harby Lane exit. Remember to assemble in the car park. Do not use the lift. If you are trapped upstairs, you can use the tilt and turn windows in both rooms 2 and 3. The security key is on a hook next to the windows. The best exit is via room 2. Turn the handle all the way up as shown and climb out. These exits are second ways out. They are not official fire exits and should not be used in a drill. Tackling the fire. The normal advice is don't. However, if the fire is small and not spreading quickly, you might consider trying to put it out. Make sure that others are leaving the building setting off the alarm and dialing 999. Extinguishers. There are three types. The blanket in the kitchen is for pan fires and to wrap around someone who is on fire. The extinguisher with the black label is a CO2 extinguisher. These are for electrical fires. First try and cut the source of power. The extinguisher with the yellow label is a foam extinguisher. Use this type for general fires, including wood and paper. These extinguishers must not be used on electrical fires. Both these can-type extinguishers are operated in similar ways. Pull off the green tie, pull the pin, aim the hose or horn at the base of the fire and squeeze the handle. Do not hold the CO2 horn as it gets very cold.